right, guys, this is Michi. Keep watching Pinax. So there is an update about Blasters former coach KC Apia. So what is it? Um, you know, say you know, CAF and uh, the Confederation of African Football with the Sema Babe Tuja it released this statement so with immediate effect. You know, we see appear to declare his stance if he is for Ghana or he is for Sudan. Now I'm saying this because this particular former Blasters coach we are learning say currently he is the uh, the national team the, the coach of the national team uh, of the Sudan and uh, the head coach for the Sudan national team. But we also know that he was and uh, uh, that he is the, the, the former Blasters coach. So the question is, so we're moving on with his career, and this is your coach for the Sudanese national team. And why is Kaf so angry about this? So it happens that Kwesi Apia, even though he uh, is not part of, he's not Ghana's coach again, he is still an executive uh, member of the Ghana uh, Football Association GFA. And ahead of Ghana versus Sudan match, no, uh, in saw no Sudan for coach, uh, FIFA for a trust, and no, there's there is something a friend of conflict of interest. So this man, no, it sounds like he's serving on a, on, a, on the board as a year. Uh, a chairman and one of the board members of the Ghana Football Association, and he also happens to be the chief coach and the head coach of the Sudanese national team. He needs to do something, he needs to step down from one of these roles. I mean, what I say, you know, calf cry the press release about. So, Benis, what is going on? Answer the Ebeka question in Sema Calf, Edia Tuja, and what is going on? Give us more details as to what is really going on. Um, so, so you know, I can't say no conflicts of interest once a minute is about to just this year. Yeah, more than you see, but she and eighty me at a team if we say on a normal sense, no, unto me and some a run whom you am I in possible. When you say being poor, a Baku or Europe and Abbey, be in African, you know, African related teams into the Camera, I say, you only say, I say, oh, I don't know, but I say, go back, find ways and means, and you'll be communicating your weakness to us. I do, but what comment section one, and I'm I never acquire me many to hope a. Reaction say if you go for her back. I'm not for which you say Anka Nesa so Munano. Hello. But but before then no, also uh CAF for a uh, press release about so we just want people to know that CAF has brought a press release. So uh before we go on to the reactions from no, uh okay. CAF at uh, the statement about they've even written a letter about a year what a year coach could say appear what he should do. Uh, what he should do and how he should step down. So, whilst we prepare to 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 uh, get this particular press release on the screen, so you were talking about some reactions. Yeah, yeah. I was talking about the fact that Nkofobi suggested that Anka, on one case, he appointed as head coach for Sudan. There was on one case, Anka, Anka, you know who free executive board and as executive council on the move to Ghana because who to me any executive member of Ghana national football team who now Anka is head coach and must Sudan. I know they are coming to say AI is a person in the media. I share to about Kuma. It is not really advisable. And maybe also a camera coach says, Yeah, no, I say Ghana for only Sudan for yeah, yeah, we'll match you where in the media. The entire Anna, uh, was happy. I call Eddie in the weakness. I come out Sudan for my house, Sudan from our Beshe Buguru, even though you said they are Sudan from Ba on Beshe from from no, but send a bear in no beer from Kosci and so to say. Sabre ya or your head coach, Eddie was to Danny. So one bad number of shares from from to send you to me as a that I know. And no, you've been no be a sign of coin because oh, because I appear on Tino on him, so as soon as he left, as soon as he bought right, as soon as he bought left, as soon as he bought center, and what communicate a mom. Okay, now so step down, dear, let's read it, or you'll be any answer. So coming into this studio, you no, know, and uh, before this particular update, we heard that Chrissy Apia, uh, based on a press release, and uh, a year in summer, the directive which came from CAF, so he needs to step down from either roles, which means yeah, either he stepped down as the head coach of the uh, Sudan. the, the, the Sudanese. Sudanese national national team, and now say he officially uh, steps down as a, an executive member of a uh, Ghana Football Association. And right before this story, you know, we are learning say uh, Kwesi Apia has said he has reached a conclusive decision as to where he, what he wants to do. And uh, breaking news, I can say, say, uh, before I be raised to the crisis, say, 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 say,
na stance away declare is so simple he's saying it's a based on whatever he's going on no? and he holding two positions currently as our two positions currently are okutano one of them no a uh, being the head coach of a uh, uh, Sudanese national team and also one of them being the executive board member of the Ghana Football Association. No? He is saying that he is choosing one. And one that he is choosing currently, you no, know, uh, said he wants to see, he, he wants to remain as a uh, the, the head coach of the Sudan national team. Which oh. means yes, which means he will be dropping as a uh, uh, the Ghana football your friend is saying executive. Or, or executive member and we are also learning that this is actually a temporal decision so uh, for those of you who are wondering so okay we see up here he has quit you know a temporal which means uh, uh, i don't know when how 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 long it will be but temporal no? a bit my one month two months three months a bit my for the unforeseeable future near the other so this is the decision now currently you know uh abe to just see i just say we can really conclude and i confirm say coach chris apia he's no more part of the executive council of the Ghana football association we also learn is uh, in regards to this particular issue you know uh chris apia failed to do the need for, because usually you know if you are serving as a head coach for another national team you make sure they don't have any ties with your national team uh, with uh, uh, your own country and i said your home your home your home country you don't have any ties with them in terms of football but we uh, see a piano sorry mc we see we see a piano let say i don't know if he felt so okay this was just normal but then he broke protocol uh on ukraine tina he is a car for ascending letter can yes sir he could have even been banned or fine now there's this press release on the screen here but help us to read it tonight into us okay so the press release okay from uh Calf. I shall always be expanding the car my uncle, but you know, Mr. James Kwesiapia and I just say, get a command, no, I'm a Ghana Football Association, Sudan Football Association, conflict of letter interest regarding your dual role as Ghana Football Association executive council member and Sudan football, football team head coach. Dear sir, it has come to our attention that you are currently holding two significant positions. That is the member of the Ghana Football Association, GFA, Executive Council, and head coach of Sudan's national football team. As you already know, Ghana and Sudan are in the same pool of uh, pool for the upcoming AFCON qualifiers, the competition. The two teams are set to face each other on the 11th and 14th of October 2024. And your dual roles create an apparent conflict of interest. This situation is contrary to the CAF status, uh, statuses, okay, and the FIFA Code of Ethics. For that reason, and to preserve the integrity of the Afcon qualifiers, I urge you to take immediate action to resolve this conflict of interest, including, at a minimum, temporarily stepping down from one of these two roles until the conclusion. Of the competition, it is a long story. Can I say, um, a temper on him, um, a young day to one is set to set a movie. We saw competition where you know, I was say, oh, to me, a step it down temporary. Okay, the temporary, which I say, because he say a movie, we afcon qualifiers now, right? That is what he's trying to insinuate right now. Please, I'm patrol and go back to my knuckle top, Kakra. Am I a near head at was so a war on them of interest? The situation is contrary to calf. Okay, I think we got there. I kindly request you to provide calf with a written confirmation and proof that you have taken the necessary steps to remedy the situation on or before Tuesday, 8 October 2024. Failure to do so results this matter being referred to calf disciplinary board. I appreciate your prompt attention to this important matter. Your sincere, your sincerely, confederation of African, African, the football. Okay, well, fellas, uh -huh. director of legal affairs. In Tinacha, say, and some of the two Jana, I just say, oh, much more say, I was on one case. Otimisina say no, chushu a muba. So we executive member for Ghana Football Association, and I say, oh, because we didn't coach you. I will call the Amas to down for no. I will say, with me, I'm back for Sally Abaya and Koye with me. I can be beer, or be on fast or bonk will be a so be anti me and mini match. And I said, you will be anti me and for I'm sure to cross and Koye be because I'm not concerned him. 
se ay ade a sa amamre we no ye nye wo nti e o wo de wo leto mbe tu je ompeso mche se se ano se de be ya so je be benti ne e wo se otimi e resign ba kwa na se o si free from o si free ba ku mu for some time let us say se go e be bosa after qualifies ni na e wi na se se after that no de wo bi o so wo de so aso no na wo mu e de ato aso na na sa e na press statement ne o pese e tre Okay, so currently, Nidia, as we are saying, for those of you who just join us, and uh, for those of you who don't know what is going on, it happens to be a coach Chris Yapia, uh, a year, uh, calf, a catch and needs to step down from either rules. And as we indicated, he has stepped down as the Ghana Blasters, uh, an uh, executive member from the Ghana Football Association. So, this is exactly what is going on. We want more updates as all of these events unfold.